Everybody ready? Okay, we're joined by head coach Terry Williams from Noise, student athletes Tiffany Lewis and Janine McKay. Coach will give us an opening statement, then we'll take questions. I thought our young ladies played a heck of a game. You know, we came out, um, we, we had our game plan, we knew what we wanted to do, and our young ladies just competed all the way to the end. You look at the score and the score is truly not indicative of how the game um, truly went, went. You know, they had a good run there with a minute and 30 left and kind of took the lead a little bit, but I'm so proud of my young ladies. Questions? Coach, um, when you guys oh, sorry. when you guys went up four in the fourth quarter, it, that seemed like a turning point, and then Tennessee just got loose. Uh, what what happened in that to make that turn around, and how did you how did your team feel when you were up four, and then how did Tennessee get loose on you? Well, when we went up by four, it was still a lot of time left, and that's what I told our young man. I think it was like five minutes left in the game. Um, our defense, once again, forced them into turnovers. We were able to score a quick buckets, put us up by four. I mean, Tennessee's playing at home, you know, a very good team. And it was five minutes and 30 seconds left in the game. It's a lot of time left in the game. Just leave this one. He might as well just hold it. Nobody else has anything to say. Um, the, I mean, you, you guys went after. Avina and Anastasia. Obviously, their freshmen have not been exposed to this level of athleticism. Did, did you see that on film that you could maybe take advantage of them because of their youth and inexperience? Tell them what we think about freshmen. Freshmen, uh, they have never seen it. And there's no way that anyone can simulate what we do. And so anytime we play, like, whether you've seen it or you haven't seen it, it's, it's the same, which you, they've never been handled with. And then Tiffany, obviously you got to sort of come home nearby. Your sister, as people know, played softball here at Tennessee. She's wearing Auburn colors, so did, did you thank her for that, even though this is her alma mater? No, she knew what to do. <laughs> <laughs> Coach, did you throw some, some different wrinkles at them with your, with your press in terms of maybe the alignment and things like that? We always do. We always do. We'll, we'll do different things. We'll deny the, the inbounder. Um, We'll deny the, the point guard. We'll do a lot of different things um, with our press to up the pressure. Tennessee did a good job in the, uh, last year in the first quarter of spreading us out um, in their press offense. And we wanted to up the, up the tempo a little bit right away. I thought our young ladies did a great job. I mean, we forced them into 28 turnovers. That's just unbelievable. For either of the players, how much do you guys feed off of those turnovers, especially in the backcourt? I mean, there are those couple when you guys just strung together two straight baskets, they call a timeout, you know it's on your side. How do you how do you guys feed off of that? It definitely gives us energy and we know that if we can get our press set up and get those turnovers that we can gain momentum offensively. And once we figure out that we can get to the basket uh, and put the ball in the hoop, um, it gives us more confidence in the half court. Thank you. For either of the players, do you feel like with that number of turnovers that maybe you might have left some some points out there that you you could have scored. Definitely. Yes. Definitely. Yes. <laughs> yeah. We, we scored 26 points off of the turnovers, but when you look at the field goal attempts, we had 79 field goal attempts to their 47. We left a whole lot of points out there on the floor. Tiffany, you you've struggled shooting a little bit, but you went, I believe, uh, four of nine in this game. Hit two of four three pointers. Does a game like this give you some more confidence offensively? Yes, it does. It gives me a lot of confidence. I mean, I just have to be consistent with it though, and believe in myself because I know I can do it. Coach, how does your team build off of this, knowing that you know this is yes, it's one loss in the SEC, but every game will be like this in this conference. Well, we understand it's competitive. I mean, we got we got a stretch of run right now. We're about to hit every top, you know, ten team in the country. At number seven, Texas A&M is coming to us. Then we go to South Carolina. I mean, for anybody that doubts that this is the best conference in the country, then I'm going to tell them come on and join us and play in this conference, and then see what you think about it. Anything else? Oh, just the turnover issues for that y'all had down. And obviously, y'all forced a ton of turnovers, and it seemed second half y'all kind of struggled in that regard. What kind of caused that? I didn't hear the question. Your own y'all forced a ton of turnovers, but you y'all had some trouble taking care of the ball down the stretch. Down just the stretch. what caused that? What was what were they doing defensively? 
Actually, honestly, and I'm not trying to take anything away from Tennessee down the stretch. I thought we just made some bad turnovers. I mean, you look at that last one where Jess took it through it, you know, right to uh, NAR. I mean, it wasn't like it was any type of pressure. I thought we got a little rattled there a little bit in the end. But you can't help but I mean, the crowd is loud, it's huge, you know, the, the fans are screaming. You know, we just got to be a little bit more poised in those situations. Anything else? Y'all have won some seven straight for this one year SEC opener. Just, where, how do you feel about where y'all stand heading into kind of the meat of the SEC schedule now? Oh, I feel good. I mean, it, honestly, we came into number seven Tennessee on their own floor, 14 and 0, and gave them a heck of a game. You know, and that that right there just gives us the confidence that we know we can continue to peak, compete with every team in this conference. We just got to play. All right. Thank you all. Thank you.